Hi guys, welcome to my Scotch Stew's channel. This is Robin and Daryl, and we're getting ready to open up another jar. And it's jewelry jar number eight. Today's date is 512. And if you see anything you want out of this jewelry jar, you can email us at myskywatch2 at gmail.com and give us a description of the item and refer to the jewelry jar number eight and the date of 512. And if while you're watching the video, you might want to also timestamp the item that you want under that video, and that way you and I will both be able to find it easily when we need to refer to it. And that's it. So let's do the jewelry roll. And this is a seven pound, two ounce. And you see that price? I think we got the message. They're $69.99. Good grief. Good grief, Charlie Brown. They're not doing the uh, points program anymore. Um, they're not doing the military discount every day anymore. They're not doing the senior citizen discount any every day anymore. It's only on a certain day. So... Yeah, that's going to impact us getting these jars immensely. So there you go. <clears throat> I know, hurry up and get you something to play with. Yes, please. Thank you. Mm -hmm. First thing we have is very lovely necklace. I love this. It looks like teardrop. Very pretty. Raindrop falling from my eyes. Well, I think that was a song. Mm -hmm. I know, I'm being silly. It has a lobster claw clasp, an extender with a bead, also got it has a tag and it says made in China and the back says that tag says the same thing let me see I'm trying to get it untwisted here Here we go. This is very pretty. It's a lobster claw clasp. And it's teardrops. Very pretty. They are cool. They're not cold, so I think they're some kind of acrylic, but they are very beautiful. They're faceted. They catch the light nicely and catch the color of your dress nicely, probably too, because of the, they're clear. I'm going to do this real quick. See how it catches the black under the black? So it would complement your dress. Very pretty. And there's that one. It's beautiful. Very beautiful. Thank you. Next we have is looks like it's made from comics paper. It looks like Casper. And that's a duck. 
Buzzy. And who's this? <coughs> Catnip. So very cute from uh, the characters on this. It's a nice paper bracelet. A nice con conversation piece. And it's great in its design. Very pretty. Very cute. The next is another stretchy bracelet. And pinks, blues, and greens. And circles and squares. Very pretty. I don't know why I'm a camera. There we go. So that you can see it. It's been kind of blurry lately. Here's a beautiful cross. I don't know if that's olive tree wood or not. It feels very wonderful. Maybe clean the winds. Camera, maybe it's worse blurry. I don't know. No, okay. I don't think so, but I will clean it real quick here. I'll turn it off, pause it. What? I should say pause it. Okay, uh, the next thing we have is Lobster Claw Clasp. This is your extender with a bead. I'm going to put it about midway. And then you have these nice silky ribbon. And these are, um, acrylic. I'll get it out in a minute. These are glass. These are all glass in here. All of the, the rest of this is glass. Now those feel acrylic, but everything else is glass. And this, I believe is glass, but I'm not positive. So you got acrylic and glass mixed in with this necklace. Let's put it on skinny. Pull up some so you can kind of see how pretty that is. Bring down the color there. So there's a blue heart there and one there. This is very pretty. These are, have a little sparkling in them. Very pretty. And these are beautiful glass stones. So these are acrylic. And these all are glass. These are acrylic. Let's bring the light back up. Very pretty. No wear on the metal at all. Thank you. Next one we have is a gorgeous necklace too. Yeah, that is pretty. I like that one. It's got it looks like gemstones in it. Now, I know I haven't tested them. But they're very pretty. And we'll cut there's the back. Pretty chain. Nowhere anywhere on these chains. You really need a longer one to show this one. Barrette style, and you can adjust this, I think. Yes, you can. On both sides. Or you can bring it up a lot higher and have a very long Y, depending on what your outfit's calling for. That's very pretty. Very, very pretty. Oh, that so washes it out. Yeah, you can't really see the beauty of it. So here we go. Thank you. The next is a clamper. It's got a little wear on the inside. Some on the edges. Very pretty enameling. It's got that swirl design. It's 
like cream going into coffee before you stir it look to me here's the sides I don't know if things are looking blurry or if my eyes are just getting blurry. There we go. There's another little bracelet here. It comes undone like that, and then you put it back like that. It's got those swirl designs. I don't think it's any initials in particular. It's in good shape. There's the underside. This is beautiful. It's a thistle with a purple stone and CZs. If I can get it to to show how pretty the purple stone is there, and it's signed Scotland in the back. It's this way. Now I know it's blurry because I can't read that. See the Scotland? See how beautiful this pen is? There's nowhere on it. This is called a thistle. Very pretty. The next uh, pen brooch we have is this little angel. She's very ornate. Very cute. Here's the back. Very pretty. <clears throat> she's not magnetic. So I believe she's brass, silver. And no, she's not silver, so she's got brass under there. Okay, the next thing we have is a pair of earrings. They're lever backs, and they're very pretty. Love those. And then we have a pair of, ooh, these are malachites. Green, beautiful. You can see the banding in there. It's very cold. Malachite earrings. Beautiful stones. Mm -hmm. We have two bangles. One's much smaller than the other. This one's very gold tone, a rich gold. Don't see any marks in it. It's magnetic, it's in great shape. I don't see any discoloration. This one also is magnetic. I don't see any marks in it, and I don't see any wear on it. So these are very pretty. Next is a little necklace. It's got Aries on it with little rhinestones, a small Rolo chain, no discoloration, and here's your lobster claw. You do have an extender. The next is a cute little heart necklace in gold tone. It's got the hook clasp. 
and there's no marking on the hook clasp. Very pretty. There's no wear on this. Very beautiful gold color. Oh, we got a mark back here. And it is a Trafari. So that is a beautiful Trafari. And I don't think I've ever seen a heart necklace like this with them. Absolutely beautiful. Put it on the, the black here. Skinny. Skinny. Okay. Uh oh, I what? can hear you. Oh. <laughs> I can hear you. Very pretty. See, there's no wear on this. Okay. The next one we have uh, is beautiful wood and acrylic. Mostly, I think this is even acrylic. It, it looks like it's got a wood grain, but it is this is all acrylic beads made to look like wood or stone you have your white beads too a little fasted let's see if we can tone that down some get a more realistic color there and that's very pretty Okay, the next piece we have is a beautiful pendant with some beautiful um, rhinestones. And on the back we have, what do we have? We have a bee with a heart. And one of these days it's going to focus. There you go. So we have a Brighton. Beautiful Brighton chain. There's your B with the heart and your clasp that has the heart on it. Beautiful Rolo chain extender. Beautiful Cobra chain. Very pretty. The next is. These are glass beads, a little stretchy bracelet with silver spacers. Now, I've never seen a double one of these, but this is an Italian charm bracelet. These are marked stainless steel. They all have some kind of mark on them. Let's see. Stainless steel 18 karat. STL 18 KT Italy. So you have to look at each of the charms. Dynaflex, stainless steel, Dynaflex. Here's um, Italy stainless steel. I don't know now, how does this work? Oh, it just stretches out. That's what it does. So it's got all kind of nice little charms on it. Clemson, it looks like Clemson. It could be somebody else who's orange helmet. Um, there's an Arizona cross, a star, Springfield Tigers, maybe that's what it's for, a flower star, a tiger paw, football helmet, basketball mom and sis, KW, 
Grandma. Ooh, Grandma made it. Yay, Grandma. Oh, there's a little picture of a baby. Somebody's baby and a cancer ribbon. Not sure what this is. Looks like um, Braves flag. Not sure what this is. Star USA. This is a very cool bracelet. It's got a lot of interesting charms on it. Looks like a hair dryer right there. Does. Okay. Let me look at that. See if I can focus on that. That yeah, could be a hairdresser. Yeah, they could have been a hairdresser. Somebody might have been a hairdresser. So yeah, that's a nice one. And it's a big one. I can just slip it right on and off. So I don't know if a guy wore this. But honey, look, there's a baby's picture on there. Oh. That makes me sad. Very sweet. The next one we have is a bracelet with a lot of pictures in it, but I don't think they're actual, honey. Okay. I think um, you can put pictures. It looks so brand new. Okay. And probably what needs to be done, I mean, it's, I don't think these are actually somebody's pictures. I mean, that one you can't even make out. Okay. So they're just showing you what types of pictures you could put in here. See, they're blurred. Except for that one. That's a cute one, that little baby one. But again, I don't think those are actual. Here's a pretty cute little disc with toggle clasp bracelet. It's even large on me with a second, so this is good for a larger hand or larger wrist. I wear seven, seven and a half between those, seven and a quarter. And this is, I still have a lot of room. Very cool. Silver tone. Nice cord. Nowhere at all. In great condition. Let's see if we can bring this down a little bit. The next is a little bar and acrylic bead with a silver bead here. I love the purple. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> this is acrylic. These are acrylic. That is pretty substantial. You can hear it. That's weighty. I could do some workout with that. There you go. <laughs> so, worried about getting flabby arms? Wear you some good honker bracelets. Give your arm a workout. Pretty blue. Pretty heavy. And the stretch is still good on this. The next is a pink. And this is stung or glass because they're very cold. I think maybe glass. Very pretty though. I could be wrong. I'm not sure, but it's cold, and it's pretty, and it's pink. And you like it. And I like it. And this is a pendant with a gold tone bell. Glass pendant, very pretty. Very unique design. Here we have a red statement necklace with black stones surrounding the red. It is a lobster claw class. You have an extender with a bead. Of 
bolo chains. Very pretty. And here's the back. There's no wear on this like it's new. Very nice. So you have this little stretchy bracelet that's made with some kind of acrylic. Beautiful orange color. Feels good on. Even though it's got that rough look. And then you have these dyed shell. And that could be an anklet. As well as a bracelet for a larger wrist. Very pretty. Have another little stretchy with clear beads with black beads in the center. And metal beads. Very pretty. Rolls on. And rolls right off. Oh, that's pretty. Very big cross. It's all black. It's metal, so it's black enamel. This is a black cabochon fasted piece in the center here. These two. For the rest of it's metal. Well, even these are metal. But this center one is not. It's actually a piece, a acrylic bead, capuchon. This is a wire necklace. It's very tarnished. So I'm not sure there's a piece of wire sticking there. Magnetic. Oh. No, it stuck oh. me. Oh. There, I laid it down. But I think that may be silver, but I'm not sure. I'm going to rub one of the little things here. Yep. You may not get much. It doesn't look like it's rubbing too much of anything. Hmm. Just don't like the way that is. No. Go ahead and rub all of this off. Okay. Did you get it on? No. Okay. Not at all, honey. <laughs> I'm not sure about this necklace. I don't see any marks on it. And it's, I guess we're just going to put it up. Just put it in the box so I can look at it more. Mm -hmm. Let me try one more time. Too much water. Just doesn't look like silver. Just bugs me. I can tell. Nope. Not silver. So get over it. It's just dark in its color. It looks tarnished, so it looks like it may have had a silver coating. And of course, I could have eased my mind by using the magnet. 
Look at there. Well, doggies. Well, doggies. <laughs> Not silver. Got a very tarnished look to it. Here's a cute little charm bracelet. Oh. And this says, what's that say? California. What's that say? Sterling. Now, what is this? Oh, it's a crate with a a little stone in there, a little ball in there. I'm, I have, don't know the significance of that. And then it's got a California state attached to it. Here's a little happy birthday charm. If that opens up or not. Yeah, it's got a hinge. Yeah, it opens. And there's a little candle inside and then this has sterling written on it good luck charm it's also has sterling written on it it's hard to read Merry Christmas with the church it's also Mark Sterling. So you have Sterling Charm, the Sterling Charm bracelet. It's got a safety chain. It's still there. In good condition. It's a box clasp. You have, you have to press on that and know how to pull it apart better than I do. Okay, why can't I get that? I can feel it pressing. You want me to talk to it? Oh my. Yes, because I can't get it. Okay. I can't undo it. While he's undoing it, figuring that out, I'll show you another bracelet. Oh, did you hear the owl? I did. That's one of the birds. <laughs> wow. Was that the owl too or some other bird? It was the owl and some other birds. Oh, man, they're fighting, I bet. 